Have you ever had this happen to you? Hello, I'm Dr. William Park with Bless Smile and Smile on You Dentistry. Today we're going to talk about sensitive teeth and what you can do to help immediately. Sensitive teeth affects millions of people every single day. It can wake you up at night, it might shock you while you're having your favorite drink or favorite ice cream, and it can be very difficult to resolve. So what's going on? Why are my teeth sensitive? And what can I do about it? Teeth sensitivity could be caused by a number of different reasons. This can include deep cavities, a heavy bite, but today we're going to focus on one of the top reasons for sensitivity, and this is called recession. Recession involves a process where your gums start to recede, or where your gums start to move down your tooth, exposing more of your tooth structure. To understand why this recession makes your tooth so sensitive, we do need to understand some very basic dental anatomy. Generally, your gums are at a certain level, which covers up a good amount of the root structure of your tooth. But with recession, over time, your gums will start to move down the tooth, and this starts to expose more of the root surface of your tooth. This root surface is not covered by the same protective layer as the rest of your tooth, and this exposed area makes the tooth very sensitive to hot and cold. We see people with sensitive teeth every single day, and the most important part of this is to figure out why the sensitivity is happening. This will involve looking at some x-rays, doing a full examination of your gums, evaluating your bite, and asking you some questions about your habits at home as far as brushing and flossing. This information will help us to develop a solution that really works for you specifically, and the solution will really depend on what exactly is causing you to be sensitive. But generally, for sensitivity related to recession, the first thing I always recommend is to try out a new sensitivity toothpaste. We use toothpaste every single day, and the one you use can really have an impact on how you look and how you feel. Some toothpaste may be dedicated to preventing cavities, Others may help to whiten up your tooth color. And there are some other toothpaste such as Sensodyne, which are really targeted at preventing the sensitivity in your teeth. The main ingredient you want to look for when looking for a anti-sensitivity toothpaste is an ingredient called potassium nitrate. This ingredient helps to prevent your teeth from sending the pain signals up to your brain. By blocking these pain signals, even when something hot or cold touches your teeth, you do not feel sensitive because the signals are being blocked. If you have any questions about the details of this process, make sure to leave a comment down below. So let's say you've watched this video, you went out to the store and you got some sensitivity toothpaste, you've tried it out for a few weeks and you're still feeling a little sensitive. Then what can you do? What are your options? Well, one option is to have your dentist place a filling or a protective restoration over this exposed root area. This has been shown to be very effective as the exposed root surface is now covered up. Another option is a surgical gum procedure. With this procedure, your gums will be used to cover up the exposed root surface of your teeth. And again, by covering the area up, the exposed root surface is now covered, and this will also help to really prevent sensitivity. And this can be a great option for many different people as well. So I really hope this video helps a lot of you out there who are suffering from sensitive teeth. If you found this video helpful, make sure to be subscribed to our channel so we can continue to make content like this. If you have any questions about anything, feel free to leave a comment down below. Also, make sure to leave a comment down below telling us about how some of our tips have helped you. If you're in the Los Angeles or Orange County area, we would love to have you come in for a consultation at our office. You can find us at smileonyoudentistry.com. Thank you for watching.